Here's all the bits for my heat exchanger. So this is the main cylinder. It's a 100mm stainless steel and it has a 4 inch triclover top and bottom. Water in pipe, water out pipe with a valve, etc. The bottom triclover has a 1500 watt element attached to it in a waterproof box with its power supply that plugs into the uh, control box. The internal guts of the heat exchanger is a copper coil that the beer runs through and it runs via triclover connects at the top to one for the beer in and one for the beer out obviously and there is a float switch attached to it so that I know what the water level is inside the heat exchanger and also a pressure release valve because there's a pressure build up inside the heat exchanger and I need to be able to release that pressure if anything gets too hot. Then these are the rest of the fittings that I've just been attaching to it while I run uh, my tests. So I sit back, put this together as quick as I can. So that's it all set up, uh, ready to test. So I put water in, well the water will come out, put water in through here to fill up the tank. As soon as the tank gets to the right level, the switch tells me that the water's at the right level. Plug in the power, put that into my control panel. As the water heats up, heats up the beer that's running through the coil. So there's a pump here. The valve and the water will run through the pump, be pulled, pushed up and into here where it goes down through the coiled heat exchanger and then back up again and out where there's another valve to control the flow and back into the mash tun again. <laughs> 